Imagine floating in the vast expanse of space, billions of twinkling stars surrounding you in a cosmic dance of ancient light. Among these celestial bodies lies our own galactic home, the Milky Way, a spiraling masterpiece of stars, gas, and dark mysteries. This isn't just a galaxy, it's a grand tapestry of cosmic history, where each star tells a story and every spiral arm cradles secrets of the universe's past and future. As we embark on a journey through the Milky Way, prepare to unravel the mysteries of this majestic galaxy, a place that's not only our home, but also a key to understanding the universe itself. The Milky Way Galaxy, a mesmerizing swirl of stars, gas, and dust, is our cosmic home in the universe. Spanning about 100,000 light years in diameter, it's a vast, spiraling galaxy that hosts billions of stars, including our own sun. It's named the Milky Way due to its appearance from Earth, a hazy band of light seen in the night sky, formed from stars that cannot be individually distinguished by the naked eye. The Milky Way is a barred spiral galaxy, a common type of galaxy in the universe. This classification is based on its distinct features, a central bulge, barred structure, spiral arms, and an extensive halo. The central bulge, dense with stars, harbors a supermassive black hole at its core, known as Sagittarius A asterisk. Surrounding this bulge is a bar-shaped region of stars, beyond which lie the spiral arms, rich in star-forming regions, an interstellar medium comprising gas and dust. Our solar system is located in one of these spiral arms, known as the Orion Arm, approximately 27,000 light-years from the galactic center. This position offers a unique vantage point for observing and understanding the galaxy's structure and components. The Milky Way is not static but dynamic. It rotates, with its outer regions taking longer to complete one orbit compared to the inner parts, a phenomenon known as differential rotation. This galaxy also interacts with and gravitates towards other galaxies in its vicinity, especially the Andromeda Galaxy with which it is predicted to collide in about 4 billion years. Understanding the Milky Way is crucial for astronomy. It provides a direct opportunity to study a galaxy's formation and evolution, stellar populations, and the interstellar medium. Our position within it offers a unique perspective to observe these phenomena, which might be challenging to study in more distant galaxies. The study of the Milky Way galaxy holds paramount importance in the field of astronomy. As our galactic home, it serves as the primary laboratory for understanding the fundamental processes and components of galaxies. Its proximity allows astronomers to observe and analyze features and phenomena that would be too faint or too distant in other galaxies. Firstly, the Milky Way is central to our understanding of galactic structure and dynamics. The study of its spiral arms, star clusters, and the central bulge provides insights into the processes of star formation and the life cycle of stars. Observations of the Milky Way have led to significant discoveries, like the existence of a supermassive black hole at its center, which is a crucial piece in understanding the dynamics of galactic nuclei. Furthermore, the Milky Way's interstellar medium, ISM, is a rich field of study. The ISM, filled with gas, dust, and cosmic rays, is the birthplace of stars and planets. Studying it helps in comprehending the chemical composition of the galaxy, the process of star formation, and the evolution of the galaxy over time. The Milky Way also serves as a key to understanding galactic evolution. By studying its structure and composition, astronomers can infer the history of its formation and the processes that have shaped its current form. This includes the study of its satellite galaxies, globular clusters, and dark matter halo, which provide clues about the galaxy's past interactions and mergers. Moreover, the Milky Way is essential for calibrating astronomical measurements. Understanding its structure helps in refining the cosmic distance ladder, which is vital for measuring distances to other galaxies. This, in turn, aids in determining the scale of the universe and the rate of its expansion. The Milky Way galaxy is classified as a barred spiral galaxy, a subtype within the broader category of spiral galaxies. Spiral galaxies are characterized by their distinctive spiral structures, which consist of a central bulge surrounded by a flat, rotating disk of stars, gas, and dust, often marked by spiral arms. The central bulge of a spiral galaxy, including the Milky Way, is densely packed with older stars, and often contains a supermassive black hole at its core. The Milky Way's central black hole, 
Sagittarius A asterisk, is a prime example of this phenomenon. Surrounding the bulge is the galactic disk, where the majority of the galaxy's stars, including newer, younger stars, are located. This disk is also rich in interstellar gas and dust, the raw materials for new star formation. One of the defining features of spiral galaxies is their spiral arms. These arms are regions of higher density within the disk, appearing like spiraling tendrils extending from the central bulge. They are often sites of active star formation, marked by the presence of young hot stars and nebulae. The rotation of spiral galaxies, including the Milky Way, is another key feature. The stars and other materials in these galaxies rotate around the center, but not at uniform speeds. The rotation curve of spiral galaxies has been instrumental in suggesting the presence of dark matter, a non-luminous and mysterious component that dominates the mass of galaxies. Barred spiral galaxies, like the Milky Way, feature a bar-shaped structure of stars extending from the central bulge into the disk. This bar influences the dynamics of the galaxy's spiral arms and overall structure. Spiral galaxies, one of the most visually striking types of galaxies in the universe, are characterized by their distinctive spiral structures. They represent a significant portion of the galaxies in the observable universe and include a wide range of sizes and forms. Definition. A spiral galaxy is defined by its spiraling flattened disk, which includes spiral arms winding outward from the central bulge. This central bulge typically contains older stars and can harbor a supermassive black hole. Surrounding the bulge and disk is a halo, often containing older stars and globular clusters. Spiral arms. The most notable feature of spiral galaxies is their arms, regions of higher density contrasted against the rest of the disk. These arms are sites of intense star formation and are often populated by young blue stars, making them bright and noticeable. Rotation. Spiral galaxies exhibit differential rotation, where the arms and outer regions of the disk rotate at different speeds compared to the inner areas. This differential rotation contributes to the winding appearance of the spiral arms. Star population. The disk of a spiral galaxy contains a mix of young and old stars, with the younger, hotter stars predominantly found in the arms. The central bulge, in contrast, generally contains older, redder stars. Interstellar medium. The disk is rich in interstellar gas and dust, the raw materials for star formation. This abundance leads to the formation of various structures like nebulae and star clusters within the arms. Galactic nucleus. The nucleus of a spiral galaxy, found in the central bulge, can be an active region with potential for significant energy release, especially if it hosts a supermassive black hole. Dark matter halo. Spiral galaxies are enveloped in a halo of dark matter, a non-luminous material that does not interact with electromagnetic radiation. The presence of dark matter is inferred from the galaxy's gravitational effects on its rotation curve and surrounding objects. While spiral galaxies share common features with other galaxy types, they also possess unique characteristics that distinguish them in the universe. Spiral Structure The most distinctive feature of spiral galaxies is their spiral arms, a pattern not found in elliptical or irregular galaxies. These arms are thought to be density waves, regions of enhanced density that rotate through the disk, triggering star formation. Star formation. Spiral galaxies, including the Milky Way, are often sites of vigorous star formation, especially in their arms. This is in contrast to elliptical galaxies, which generally consist of older stars and exhibit little to no star formation. Dust and gas. Content. Spiral galaxies have a significantly higher proportion of interstellar gas and dust compared to elliptical galaxies. This abundance is crucial for star formation and contributes to the galaxy's spiral structure. Active galactic nucleus. Some spiral galaxies exhibit active galactic nuclei, AGN, where the central supermassive black hole is accreting matter at a high rate, emitting substantial amounts of energy. This activity can have significant effects on the galaxy's evolution and its surroundings. Barred structure. A significant proportion of spiral galaxies, including the Milky Way, are barred spirals. These galaxies feature a central bar structure that extends from the nucleus into the disk. The bar affects the dynamics of the galaxy, influencing the motion of stars and gas, and possibly playing a role in the formation and maintenance of the spiral arms. Differential rotation. The rotation of spiral galaxies is not uniform. 
the outer parts of the disc rotate at different speeds than the inner regions. This differential rotation is key to understanding the galaxy's mass distribution, especially the presence of dark matter. Galactic Evolution Spiral galaxies are often in a stage of evolution that is intermediate between young, irregular galaxies and older, elliptical galaxies. This evolutionary position provides insights into the processes that shape galaxies over cosmic time. The Milky Way, as a barred spiral galaxy, can be contrasted with other major types of galaxies, particularly elliptical and irregular galaxies. These different galaxy types vary in their structure, composition, star formation activity, and overall dynamics, offering diverse perspectives on galactic evolution and processes. Elliptical Galaxies These galaxies are characterized by their ellipsoidal shape and lack the distinct spiral structure seen in spiral galaxies like the Milky Way. They range from nearly spherical to highly elongated shapes and are predominantly composed of older red stars with very little interstellar gas and dust. Elliptical galaxies often form in regions with higher galaxy densities and are thought to be the result of galaxy mergers. Irregular galaxies. As the name suggests, irregular galaxies lack a defined shape, falling outside the classifications of spiral or elliptical galaxies. They often appear chaotic in structure, with no central bulge or spiral arms. Irregular galaxies are typically rich in gas and dust and exhibit active star formation. They are often smaller and less massive than spiral and elliptical galaxies and are believed to be in an earlier stage of galactic evolution. Comparing the Milky Way to these galaxy types highlights the diversity in the universe's galactic population. While the Milky Way demonstrates structured, ongoing star formation and a balanced composition of young and old stars, elliptical and irregular galaxies offer contrasting scenarios of galactic composition, structure, and life cycle. Elliptical galaxies represent a significant contrast to spiral galaxies like the Milky Way in several key aspects. They are one of the main types of galaxies in the Hubble sequence, a morphological classification scheme for galaxies. Structure and appearance. Unlike the distinct disk and spiral arms of spiral galaxies, elliptical galaxies have a smooth, featureless appearance with an ellipsoidal shape. They lack a flat disk and spiral structure, resulting in a more uniform brightness profile from the center to the edges. Star population, elliptical galaxies primarily consist of older red stars, indicating a lack of recent star formation. They are often referred to as red and dead galaxies due to their aging star population and the absence of significant new star formation. Interstellar medium. In contrast to the gas-rich environment of spiral galaxies, elliptical galaxies have very little interstellar gas and dust. This scarcity of raw materials for star formation is why these galaxies have a low rate of star formation compared to spirals. Size and mass. Elliptical galaxies vary greatly in size and mass. They can be some of the smallest galaxies known as dwarf ellipticals, or among the largest galaxies in the universe, like giant ellipticals found at the centers of galaxy clusters. Formation and Evolution The formation of elliptical galaxies is often attributed to the merging of smaller galaxies. This merger process can disrupt the structure of the original galaxies, resulting in the ellipsoidal shape. The merging process also exhausts the available gas, ceasing new star formation and leaving behind older stars. Galactic Nucleus The cores of elliptical galaxies are generally less active than those of spiral galaxies. However, some elliptical galaxies can host active galactic nuclei, AGN, especially in cases where they have accreted material from other galaxies or the intergalactic medium. Dark Matter Halo like spiral galaxies, elliptical galaxies are also enveloped in a dark matter halo, which plays a significant role in their overall dynamics and mass distribution. Irregular galaxies stand out in the universe for their lack of a defined structure, differing significantly from the organized appearance of spiral and elliptical galaxies. Structure and Appearance Irregular galaxies lack a coherent structure. They do not have the defined spiral arms of spiral galaxies, nor the ellipsoidal shape of elliptical galaxies. Their appearance is often chaotic and patchy, with no clear symmetry or pattern. Star Population These galaxies are often rich in young blue stars, indicating active and ongoing star formation. 
This is in stark contrast to elliptical galaxies and is more similar to the star-forming regions of spiral galaxies. Interstellar medium. Irregular galaxies contain abundant interstellar gas and dust, providing the raw materials for active star formation. This high content of gas and dust is a significant factor in their irregular appearance and active star formation. Size and mass. Many irregular galaxies are smaller and less massive compared to spiral and elliptical galaxies. They are often considered to be in an earlier stage of galactic evolution, possibly evolving into more structured galaxies over time. Formation and evolution. The exact process of formation and evolution of irregular galaxies is not as well understood as for spiral and elliptical galaxies. They may form from the disruption of larger galaxies due to gravitational interactions or could be in an early stage of galactic development. Galactic nucleus. Irregular galaxies typically do not have a well-defined nucleus like spiral or elliptical galaxies. Their centers are often less distinct and not as prominently featured. Dark matter halo. Similar to other galaxy types, irregular galaxies are also believed to be surrounded by a dark matter halo, although the exact distribution and impact of dark matter in these galaxies might differ due to their irregular structure. The structure of the Milky Way galaxy is a complex and multifaceted system comprising various distinct components. These components work together to form the galaxy's overall structure and influence its behavior and evolution. Central Bulge the Milky Way has a central bulge, a densely packed area of stars located at the heart of the galaxy. This bulge is spheroidal or bar-shaped and contains a mix of older stars, showing less activity in terms of star formation compared to other parts of the galaxy. Galactic Disk Surrounding the central bulge is the galactic disk, a vast flat layer that includes the majority of the galaxy's stars, gas, and dust. This is where most of the galaxy's star formation activity occurs. The disk is also home to the Milky Way's spiral arms, where star formation is particularly active. Spiral arms. The Milky Way's spiral arms are regions of high star density, rich in interstellar gas and dust. These arms are the sites of ongoing star formation, giving birth to new stars and contributing to the galaxy's dynamic nature. Halo. Beyond the disk lies the galactic halo, a spherical region that surrounds the galaxy. The halo contains old stars, globular clusters, and is believed to be filled with dark matter, which contributes significantly to the galaxy's mass and gravitational pull. Dark Matter Halo The Milky Way, like other galaxies, is enveloped in a halo of dark matter, an invisible material that does not emit or absorb light. The presence of dark matter is inferred from its gravitational effects on the motion of stars and gas in the galaxy. These components illustrate the complexity and diversity within the Milky Way galaxy, each playing a unique role in its structure and function. The core of the Milky Way galaxy is a densely packed and dynamic region, rich in astronomical phenomena and crucial to our understanding of the galaxy. Location and structure. The galactic core is located at the center of the Milky Way, encompassed by the central bulge. It is a densely populated area with a high concentration of stars, gas, and dust. Supermassive black hole. At the very center of the Milky Way's core lies Sagittarius A asterisk, a supermassive black hole. This black hole plays a pivotal role in the dynamics of the galaxy's core, exerting a strong gravitational influence on its surroundings. It is also an area of high-energy astronomical phenomena, including the emission of X-rays and radio waves. Star Population the core hosts a variety of stars, including older red giants as well as younger, hotter stars. The presence of young stars in such a dense environment is a subject of ongoing research, posing questions about star formation under extreme conditions. Star clusters and stellar dynamics. The core region contains numerous star clusters, including some of the densest known, such as the Arches Cluster. The dynamics of stars in this region are heavily influenced by the central black hole's gravitational force, leading to high velocities and complex orbital paths. Gas and dust. The core is rich in interstellar gas and dust, which are key to star formation. However, the intense gravitational and radiative forces near the black hole can disrupt the normal processes of star formation. Magnetic fields and activity. The galactic core exhibits strong magnetic fields, which interact with the gas and dust, influencing the movement and behavior of these materials. 
The area is also a source of various high-energy events and emissions, likely linked to the activity around the black hole. Research Significance Studying the core of the Milky Way provides insights into the nature of supermassive black holes, the dynamics of densely packed star systems, and the processes occurring in extreme environments. It also helps astronomers understand similar phenomena in other galaxies. The spiral arms of the Milky Way are among its most distinctive and dynamic features, playing a crucial role in the galaxy's structure and star formation processes. Formation and structure. Spiral arms are long, curved regions extending from the central bulge. They are formed due to density waves, gravitational perturbations that move through the disk of the galaxy. These waves compress gas and dust, triggering star formation. Star formation. The arms are rich in molecular clouds, the cold, dense regions of gas and dust where new stars are born. The compression of these clouds in the spiral arms leads to the formation of new stars, particularly massive bright stars that light up the arms. Composition. Apart from star-forming regions, the spiral arms contain a mix of young blue stars, older stars, and various interstellar objects like nebulae and star clusters. The contrast in star ages and types gives the arms their distinctive appearance. Dynamics. The rotation of the Milky Way causes the spiral arms to appear as though they are winding around the galaxy. However, the arms themselves do not rotate in this manner. Rather, they are density waves through which stars and gas move. Galactic Ecology The spiral arms play a significant role in the galactic ecosystem. They are not only sites of star birth, but also influence the distribution and density of interstellar medium components throughout the galaxy. Observational Challenges Studying the Milky Way's spiral arms is challenging due to our position within one of these arms. This limits our perspective and makes mapping the full structure of the arms complex. Importance in galactic evolution. The formation and evolution of spiral arms are key to understanding the overall evolution of spiral galaxies. They are indicative of dynamic processes within the galactic disk and are crucial for the recycling of gas and dust in the galaxy. The halo of the Milky Way is a vast spherical component that envelops the galaxy's disk and bulge. It is an essential part of the galaxy providing insights into its formation, structure, and evolution. Structure and Composition The halo is predominantly made up of dark matter, which exerts a significant gravitational influence on the galaxy. The exact nature of dark matter remains one of the great mysteries in astrophysics, but its presence is crucial for explaining the observed dynamics of galaxies. Globular clusters Scattered throughout the halo are globular clusters, which are tight, spherical collections of stars. These clusters are among the oldest objects in the galaxy, containing some of the first stars to form in the Milky Way. Their stars are generally old, less metal-rich, and exhibit similar motion, orbiting the galactic center as a coherent group. Galactic History The halo and its globular clusters provide valuable clues about the Milky Way's early history and formation. The distribution, composition, and dynamics of the globular clusters help astronomers understand how the galaxy formed and evolved over billions of years. Interaction with other galaxies The halo is also the region where interactions with satellite galaxies and intergalactic material occur. These interactions can result in tidal streams, streams of stars and gas stripped from smaller galaxies and globular clusters due to the Milky Way's gravitational pull. Dark Matter Halo Surrounding the visible halo is the Dark Matter Halo, a much larger and more massive region that dominates the galaxy's total mass. The study of the Dark Matter Halo is crucial for understanding the mass distribution and gravitational dynamics of the galaxy. The galactic disk is a prominent feature of the Milky Way, hosting a diverse range of astronomical phenomena and playing a crucial role in the galaxy's life and evolution. Structure. The disk is a flattened, rotating region that contains most of the galaxy's visible matter, including stars, gas, and dust. It extends from the edge of the bulge to the outer limits of the galaxy. Star formation. The disk is the primary site of star formation in the Milky Way, this is facilitated by the abundant interstellar medium, the raw material for new stars found within the disk. Spiral arms. The disk is also where the Milky Way spiral arms are located. 
These arms are regions of higher density and are prominent sites of star formation, hosting many young, hot stars and nebulae. Population of stars. The disk contains a mix of old and young stars. Younger stars are generally found in the spiral arms, while older stars are distributed throughout the disk. Interstellar medium. The interstellar medium within the disk is a complex mix of gas and dust, playing a vital role in the life cycle of stars and the galaxy as a whole. It is the region where various processes, such as the formation of molecular clouds and the ionization caused by young stars, occur. Galactic Dynamics The disk's rotation and its gravitational interaction with the bulge and halo contribute significantly to the overall dynamics and stability of the galaxy. The star population in the Milky Way's galactic disk is diverse and dynamic, reflecting various stages of stellar evolution and processes. Distribution of Stars The disk hosts a wide range of star types from young massive blue stars to older red giants. The younger stars are primarily found in the spiral arms, where star formation is most active. In contrast, older stars are more evenly distributed across the disk. Star formation. The process of star formation in the disk is ongoing and dynamic. Regions known as molecular clouds, dense concentrations of gas and dust, are the primary sites where new stars are born. The spiral arms, with their high density of molecular clouds, are particularly active in star formation. Stellar evolution, the life cycle of stars, from their formation in molecular clouds to their eventual death, plays out across the galactic disk. Massive stars burn out quickly and end their lives in spectacular supernova, while smaller stars, like our sun, have longer lifespans and end as white dwarfs. Metallicity, stars in the disk show a range of metallicities, with younger stars generally having higher metal content. This is because each generation of stars contributes more heavy elements to the interstellar medium, from which new stars form. Star Clusters The disk contains numerous open star clusters, which are groups of stars that form together from the same molecular cloud. These clusters can provide valuable information about the process of star formation and the evolution of stars. Variable Stars the disk is also home to various types of variable stars, whose brightness changes over time. Studying these stars helps astronomers understand stellar properties and distances. Impact on galactic ecology. The life cycle of stars in the disk influences the galaxy's ecology. Supernovae, for example, play a crucial role in redistributing materials throughout the interstellar medium, driving the evolution of the galaxy. The interstellar medium, ISM, within the galactic disk, is a critical component of the Milky Way, influencing the process of star formation and the evolution of the galaxy. Composition. The ISIM is composed of gas, mostly hydrogen and helium, and dust. It exists in various forms from hot ionized gas to cold molecular clouds. Role in star formation. Molecular clouds in the ISIM are the primary sites of star formation. These clouds collapse under their own gravity, leading to the birth of new stars. The process of star formation also influences the ISM, as energy and materials from stars, especially from supernovae, are injected back into the medium. Gas Dynamics The dynamics of the gas within the ISM are complex, influenced by gravitational forces, stellar winds, supernovae, and magnetic fields. These dynamics are critical for the formation of structures like molecular clouds, H2 regions, areas of ionized hydrogen around young stars, and nebulae. Dust properties. Dust in the ISM plays a key role in absorbing and scattering light, affecting the appearance of the galaxy. It is also a crucial element in the chemistry of the ISM, including the formation of molecules. Temperature and density variations. The ISM exhibits a wide range of temperatures and densities, from hot ionized regions to cold, dense molecular clouds. These variations are essential for the diverse processes and phenomena observed in the ISM. Regulation of galactic processes. The ISM is not just a passive component. It actively regulates processes within the galaxy. For instance, the distribution and density of the ISM can control the rate of star formation. Interactions with other components. The ISM interacts with other galactic components, such as stars, the galactic halo and the central bulge. These interactions can lead to phenomena like galactic fountains and chimneys, 
where hot gas from the disk rises into the halo and then cools and returns. The Milky Way is a prominent member of the local group, a galaxy cluster that comprises over 54 galaxies, including spiral, elliptical, and irregular galaxies. The local group spans approximately 10 million light years and is part of the larger Virgo supercluster. Structure of the local group The local group is characterized by its two dominant spiral galaxies, the Milky Way and the Andromeda Galaxy, M31. These two galaxies, along with their satellite galaxies, form the core of the group. The remaining members are smaller galaxies, including both spiral and irregular types. Position of the Milky Way The Milky Way is one of the larger galaxies in the local group and exerts significant gravitational influence within the group. It is located roughly at one end of the local group, with Andromeda near the opposite end. Satellite Galaxies the Milky Way has several smaller satellite galaxies, including the Large and Small Magellanic Clouds, which are irregular galaxies visible from the Southern Hemisphere. These satellites are gravitationally bound to the Milky Way and interact with it in various ways. Importance of the Local Group Studying the Milky Way within the context of the Local Group provides valuable insights into galaxy formation and evolution. The interactions between galaxies in the Local Group including gravitational effects and occasional collisions, play a significant role in shaping their structures and star formation activities. The local group, being relatively isolated in the universe, offers a controlled environment to study these processes and understand the dynamics of galaxy clusters. B. Interaction with nearby galaxies, 300 words. The Milky Way actively interacts with nearby galaxies, primarily within the local group. These interactions, ranging from gravitational tugs to actual collisions, have profound effects on the structure and evolution of the involved galaxies. Andromeda Galaxy The most significant interaction is with the Andromeda Galaxy, our nearest spiral galaxy neighbor. The Milky Way and Andromeda are gravitationally bound and are predicted to collide in about 4 billion years. This eventual collision will significantly reshape both galaxies. Magellanic Clouds the Large and Small Magellanic Clouds are two other notable galaxies that interact with the Milky Way. These interactions include the transfer of gas and the potential for past and future collisions. Galactic Tides and Streams The gravitational forces between the Milky Way and these nearby galaxies can create tidal streams, elongated trails of stars and gas pulled from the smaller galaxies. These streams are valuable for understanding the gravitational effects and the dark matter halo of the Milky Way. Star formation and galactic evolution. Interactions with nearby galaxies can trigger star formation within the galaxies and influence their evolution. For example, collisions and close encounters can compress gas clouds, leading to the formation of new stars. Overall, the interactions of the Milky Way with nearby galaxies play a crucial role in the cosmic dance of galaxies, influencing their shape, size, and star-forming activities. The interaction between the Milky Way and the Andromeda Galaxy is a significant event in the life of both galaxies and has been a focus of study in astronomy. Future Collision The most dramatic aspect of the Milky Way-Andromeda interaction is the predicted collision in about 4 billion years. This collision will be a monumental event, leading to the merging of the two galaxies into a new galaxy type, often referred to as Milkomeda or Milkdromeda. Gravitational effects. Even before the collision, the gravitational pull between the Milky Way and Andromeda is influencing each galaxy. This gravitational interaction can lead to warping or distortion of the galaxy's disks and may trigger star formation in certain regions. Simulation studies. Astronomers use computer simulations to predict the outcome of the collision. These simulations suggest that while the galaxy's stars are unlikely to collide directly, the interaction will significantly disrupt the galaxy's structures, leading to a reshaping of the spiral arms and the creation of new star-forming regions. Galactic nuclei. The supermassive black holes at the centers of both galaxies will play a crucial role in the dynamics of the collision. Eventually, they are expected to merge, forming an even larger supermassive black hole at the center of the new galaxy. Stellar dynamics. The collision will also have a significant impact on the orbits of stars within both galaxies. 
While most stars will not collide due to the vast distances between them, their orbits will be altered and new stellar systems will be formed. Impact on galactic satellites. The interaction will also affect the satellite galaxies of both the Milky Way and Andromeda. Some of these satellites may be stripped away, while others may be drawn into the newly formed galaxy. Long-term evolution. The merger will mark a new stage in the evolution of both galaxies. The resulting galaxy will likely be an elliptical galaxy, marking the end of the spiral structure of both the Milky Way and Andromeda. The Magellanic Clouds, consisting of the Large Magellanic Cloud, LMC, and the Small Magellanic Cloud, SMC, are two irregular galaxies that are satellite galaxies of the Milky Way. Their interaction with the Milky Way is a subject of significant interest in astronomy. Orbital Interaction the Magellanic Clouds are currently orbiting the Milky Way. Their orbits are influenced by the Milky Way's gravitational pull, leading to complex interactions that include tidal forces and the transfer of material. Star Formation The interaction between the Magellanic Clouds and the Milky Way can trigger star formation in all three galaxies. The gravitational forces can compress gas in the galaxies, leading to the formation of new stars. Magellanic Stream one of the most notable features resulting from this interaction is the Magellanic Stream, a long trail of gas extending from the clouds. This stream is thought to be the result of gravitational interaction with the Milky Way, which strips gas from the clouds. Impact on the Milky Way The interaction with the Magellanic Clouds affects the Milky Way as well. The influx of gas from the clouds can fuel star formation in the Milky Way and contribute to the dynamics of the Milky Way's halo. Future Evolution The future of the Magellanic Clouds is closely tied to the Milky Way. There is evidence to suggest that the LMC might eventually collide with the Milky Way, which could have significant implications for the structure and star formation activity in our galaxy. Galactic Cannibalism the interaction between the Milky Way and the Magellanic Clouds is an example of galactic cannibalism, where a larger galaxy, the Milky Way, gravitationally affects and eventually absorbs smaller galaxies, the Magellanic Clouds. Research Importance Studying the interaction between the Milky Way and the Magellanic Clouds provides insights into the processes of galaxy interactions, the dynamics of satellite galaxies, and the impact of such interactions on galaxy evolution. The study of the Milky Way has a rich history, marked by significant observations and theories that have shaped our understanding of the galaxy and the universe. Early observations. Ancient civilizations across the world observed the Milky Way, often incorporating it into their myths and legends. However, it was not until the invention of the telescope in the early 17th century that a more scientific study of the Milky Way began. Telescopic Discoveries Galileo Galilei was among the first to observe the Milky Way through a telescope, discovering that it was composed of countless stars. This was a significant departure from the earlier belief that the Milky Way was a nebulous entity. Island Universes Theory In the 18th century, philosopher Immanuel Kant and astronomer William Herschel proposed that the Milky Way was a large disk of stars, and Herschel attempted to map its structure. They also speculated about the existence of other such island universes, a concept that foreshadowed the modern understanding of galaxies. Shapley-Curtis Debate In the early 20th century, astronomers Harlow Shapley and Heber Curtis debated the size of the Milky Way and the nature of the nebulae. Shapley argued for a large Milky Way with the Sun far from the center, while Curtis suggested that nebulae were separate galaxies. This debate was crucial in shaping our understanding of the Milky Way's size and our position within it. Discovery of Galactic Rotation The observation that the Milky Way rotates came in the early 20th century, leading to a better understanding of its dynamic nature. These historical studies laid the foundation for modern astronomy, transforming our view of the Milky Way from a mysterious band of light to a vast galaxy full of stars, gas, and dust. Modern research in astronomy has been revolutionized by new technologies and methods leading to groundbreaking discoveries about the Milky Way and the universe. Radio astronomy. The advent of radio astronomy in the 20th century opened up new ways of observing the Milky Way, allowing astronomers to see beyond visible light. 
This led to the discovery of new structures and components within the galaxy that are not visible in optical light. Space Telescopes The deployment of space telescopes, free from the distortions of the Earth's atmosphere, has provided unprecedented views of the Milky Way and distant galaxies. Instruments like the Hubble Space Telescope have captured detailed images and spectra, leading to new insights into the structure and evolution of galaxies. High-energy astronomy, observations in other wavelengths such as X-rays and gamma rays, have unveiled high-energy processes in the Milky Way, such as those occurring around the supermassive black hole at its center. Exoplanet Discovery the search for planets outside our solar system has been a major focus of modern astronomy. Techniques such as transit photometry and radial velocity measurements have led to the discovery of thousands of exoplanets, many within the Milky Way, providing insights into planetary systems formation and diversity. Dark matter and dark energy. Modern observations and theoretical work have suggested the existence of dark matter and dark energy which constitute a significant portion of the universe's total mass energy content. These findings have profound implications for our understanding of the Milky Way's structure and dynamics. These modern techniques and discoveries have greatly expanded our knowledge of the Milky Way, providing a more detailed and comprehensive understanding of our galaxy. Radio astronomy has been instrumental in advancing our understanding of the Milky Way, revealing aspects of the galaxy that are invisible in optical light. Discovery of the Galactic Center Radio astronomy led to the discovery of the Galactic Center in the 1930s. Carl Jansky, the father of radio astronomy, detected radio waves emanating from the center of the Milky Way, identifying Sagittarius A as a significant source of radio emissions. Structure of the Milky Way Radio observations have been crucial in mapping the structure of the Milky Way, particularly its spiral arms and interstellar medium. The 21 centimeters hydrogen line, a specific radio frequency emitted by neutral hydrogen, has allowed astronomers to map the distribution of hydrogen gas in the galaxy. Interstellar medium. Radio astronomy provides insights into the properties of the interstellar medium, including its temperature, density, and magnetic fields. Observations of molecular lines in the radio spectrum have led to the discovery of complex molecules and the study of star-forming regions pulsars and neutron stars. The discovery of pulsars, rapidly rotating neutron stars that emit regular pulses of radio waves, was made possible through radio astronomy. Pulsars have been used to probe the Milky Way structure and test theories of gravity. Cosmic Microwave Background Radio astronomy has also played a role in detecting and studying the cosmic microwave background, CMB, the remnant radiation from the Big Bang, which has been essential in cosmological studies. Active galactic nucleus. Observations in radio wavelengths have revealed the presence of an active galactic nucleus at the center of the Milky Way, providing evidence of the supermassive black hole and its interactions with the surrounding environment. Extragalactic astronomy. Beyond the Milky Way, radio astronomy has been pivotal in studying other galaxies, their formation, evolution, and the large-scale structure of the universe. Radio astronomy has significantly expanded our understanding of the Milky Way, complementing observations in other wavelengths and revealing the galaxy's hidden facets. Space telescopes have revolutionized our understanding of the Milky Way by providing a clear, unobstructed view of the galaxy and the universe. Hubble Space Telescope, HST. Since its launch in 1990, the HST has provided stunning images and vital data on various aspects of the Milky Way. It has been instrumental in studying the galaxy's star formation, the composition of its interstellar medium, and the properties of its stars. Chandra X-ray Observatory Chandra specializes in X-ray astronomy, revealing high-energy processes in the Milky Way. It has provided insights into phenomena such as supernova remnants, the hot gas in the galaxy, and the activity around the supermassive black hole. Spitzer Space Telescope Spitzer operated in the infrared spectrum, allowing it to peer through dust clouds that obscure other wavelengths. It has contributed to the understanding of star formation, the structure of the Milky Way, and the distribution of dust and gas. Gaia Mission the Gaia spacecraft, launched by the European Space Agency, is mapping the positions, distances, and motions of stars in the Milky Way with unprecedented precision. 
This is providing a detailed 3D map of the galaxy and transforming our understanding of its structure and evolution. James Webb Space Telescope, JWST. The JWST, designed to observe in infrared, is expected to provide deeper insights into the early stages of star and planet formation in the Milky Way, as well as the properties of the interstellar medium. Exoplanet Research. Space telescopes like the Kepler and TESS missions have been crucial in discovering and studying exoplanets in the Milky Way, greatly expanding our knowledge of planets beyond our solar system. Dark Matter and Dark Energy Observations from space telescopes have been key in studying the effects of dark matter and dark energy on the Milky Way and the universe. The future evolution of the Milky Way is a subject of significant interest in astronomy, combining observations and theoretical models to predict how our galaxy will evolve over billions of years. Star Formation The rate of star formation in the Milky Way is expected to continue, although it will gradually slow down as the available gas for forming new stars is depleted. Over time, this will lead to a decrease in the number of young hot stars and an increase in older cooler stars. Stellar evolution. As existing stars age, they will go through the various stages of stellar evolution. Massive stars will end their lives in supernovae, leaving behind neutron stars or black holes, while smaller stars like our sun will become red giants and eventually fade into white dwarfs. Galactic structure. The overall structure of the Milky Way may change over time. The spiral arms, while maintained by density waves, could become less pronounced as star formation slows and stars disperse. Dark matter. The role of dark matter in the galaxy's future evolution is still a subject of research. Its gravitational influence will continue to play a significant role in the galaxy's dynamics and structure. Interactions with satellite galaxies. The Milky Way will continue to interact with its satellite galaxies. These interactions can lead to the accretion of smaller galaxies, altering the Milky Way's structure and star population. Overall, the Milky Way's evolution will be marked by a gradual transformation, influenced by the life cycle of its stars, the dynamics of its structure, and its interactions with other galaxies. In addition to its internal evolution, the Milky Way's future is also shaped by potential collisions with other galaxies, most notably with the Andromeda Galaxy, and the Large Magellanic Cloud. Collision with Andromeda The most significant upcoming event in the Milky Way's future is its predicted collision with the Andromeda Galaxy. This event, expected to occur in about 4 billion years, will be a slow process, resulting in the merging of the two galaxies into a single larger galaxy. This collision will dramatically alter the structure of both galaxies. Interaction with the Large Magellanic Cloud before the Andromeda collision, the Milky Way is likely to have a significant interaction with the Large Magellanic Cloud, LMC. The LMC, currently a satellite galaxy of the Milky Way, is gradually getting closer and could collide with the Milky Way in the next few billion years. This collision could stir up the Milky Way's structure and trigger new rounds of star formation. Galactic merger. The merger process with Andromeda will involve complex gravitational interactions, leading to the formation of new star systems and possibly a central elliptical structure. The solar system's fate in this merger is uncertain, but it is unlikely to be directly impacted due to the vast distances between stars. These potential collisions and mergers are part of the natural life cycle of galaxies in the universe. They play a crucial role in the evolution of galaxies, leading to new structures and star formation patterns. The predicted evolution of the Milky Way over billions of years encompasses various aspects, from changes in its star population to alterations in its overall structure. Continued star formation. The Milky Way will continue to form new stars, albeit at a declining rate. As the available gas in the galaxy is used up, the rate of star formation will decrease, this will result in a gradual increase in the proportion of older red stars compared to younger blue stars. Aging of stars. The existing stars in the Milky Way will age and evolve. Massive stars will end their lives in supernova explosions, contributing heavy elements to the interstellar medium and leaving behind compact remnants like neutron stars or black holes. Less massive stars, like the Sun, will become red giants before shedding their outer layers and ending up as white dwarfs. Change in galactic structure. The spiral structure of the Milky Way may evolve over time, 
As star formation decreases and existing stars move out of their current orbits due to gravitational interactions, the distinct spiral pattern may become less pronounced. Interactions with satellite galaxies. The Milky Way's interactions with its satellite galaxies will continue to influence its evolution. These interactions can lead to the accretion of smaller galaxies, which can bring new gas into the Milky Way, potentially triggering new rounds of star formation. Dark matter influence. The Milky Way's dark matter halo will continue to play a key role in its dynamics. The exact impact of dark matter on the galaxy's long-term evolution is an area of ongoing research. Galactic bulge and center. The central region of the Milky Way, including its bulge and supermassive black hole, will also evolve. The dynamics of stars and gas around the central black hole may change, potentially influencing the activity in this region. The future of the Milky Way is also influenced by potential collisions with other galaxies, an integral part of the life cycle of galaxies in the universe. Collision with Andromeda Galaxy The most significant upcoming event is the predicted collision with the Andromeda Galaxy. This event will fundamentally transform both galaxies. Initially, their mutual gravitational pull will draw them together, leading to a series of close passes before they eventually merge. Galactic merger process. During the collision, the stars within each galaxy are unlikely to collide directly due to the vast distances between them. However, the gravitational interactions will significantly disrupt the galaxy's structures, leading to the formation of new patterns of stars and possibly a central elliptical structure. Fate of the solar system. The fate of our solar system in this merger is uncertain. While it is unlikely to be destroyed, its position in the resulting galaxy may change, and it could be thrown into a different orbit around the galaxy's center. Star formation. The collision is expected to trigger intense periods of star formation as gas clouds in the two galaxies collide and compress. This could lead to the creation of many new stars and star systems. Interaction with the Large Magellanic Cloud. Prior to the Andromeda collision, the Milky Way is likely to interact with the Large Magellanic Cloud. This interaction could alter the Milky Way's structure and possibly trigger new star formation, reshaping parts of the galaxy. Long-term outcomes. The long-term outcome of these collisions is the formation of a new galaxy, often referred to as Milkometa or Milkdromeda. This galaxy will likely be larger and have a different structure compared to the current spiral forms of the Milky Way and Andromeda. Role in galactic evolution. These collisions are a natural part of the evolutionary process of galaxies. They play a crucial role in shaping galaxy structures, triggering star formation, and driving the evolution of galaxies over cosmic timescales. The Milky Way, our galactic home, presents a fascinating subject in the field of astronomy, offering insights into the structure, evolution, and dynamics of galaxies. Classification and structure. Classified as a barred spiral galaxy, the Milky Way features a central bulge, spiral arms, and a surrounding halo. Its spiral arms are sites of active star formation, while the central bulge hosts older stars and a supermassive black hole. Galactic Components The galaxy is composed of various components, including the galactic core, spiral arms, a disk populated with stars and interstellar medium, and an outer halo that includes dark matter and globular clusters. Place in the Universe The Milky Way is a significant member of the local group of galaxies and interacts with nearby galaxies, including the Andromeda Galaxy and the Magellanic Clouds. These interactions play a crucial role in shaping the galaxy's structure and evolution. Research and Discoveries Historical observations have transformed our understanding of the Milky Way from a nebulous band in the sky to a vast galaxy full of stars and other celestial objects. Modern techniques such as radio astronomy and space telescopes have furthered this understanding, revealing details about the galaxy's structure, star population, and the presence of phenomena like black holes. Future Prospects The future of the Milky Way includes continued star formation, although at a decreasing rate, and significant changes resulting from interactions and potential collisions with neighboring galaxies, particularly Andromeda. The study of the Milky Way is not just about understanding our galaxy, but also about gaining insights into the broader universe. Galactic Archetype As a barred spiral galaxy, the Milky Way serves as a model for understanding other spiral galaxies. 
Its structure, dynamics, and evolution provide a template that can be applied to similar galaxies across the universe. Star Formation and Evolution By studying the process of star formation and the life cycle of stars in the Milky Way, astronomers can gain insights into stellar evolution in general. This includes understanding the role of different types of stars in galactic ecology, the impact of supernovae on the interstellar medium, and the formation of compact objects like neutron stars and black holes. Galactic Dynamics The Milky Way is a prime example for studying galactic dynamics, including rotation curves and the distribution of dark matter. These studies are essential for understanding the mass distribution within galaxies and the role of dark matter in the universe. Galactic Interactions The interactions of the Milky Way with its satellite galaxies and the predicted collision with Andromeda provide a real-time laboratory for studying the dynamics of galaxy interactions, mergers, and their role in galactic evolution. Exoplanetary Systems The discovery and study of exoplanets in the Milky Way have profound implications for understanding planetary systems across the universe. This includes insights into the variety of planetary systems, the conditions for planet formation, and the potential for habitable worlds. Cosmological Context The Milky Way's place within the local group and the larger structure of the universe contributes to our understanding of the formation and evolution of galaxy clusters and superclusters. This helps in mapping the large-scale structure of the universe and understanding its evolution. Testing Ground for Astrophysical Theories The Milky Way offers a testing ground for various astrophysical theories, including gravity, the nature of dark matter and dark energy, and the processes governing star and galaxy formation. Cultural and historical significance Beyond its scientific value, the Milky Way holds a special place in human culture and history. Its study has been integral to our understanding of our place in the universe and has inspired countless myths, stories, and scientific inquiries.